This is the the street lit books, the acceptable street lit books for teens. That, and this is like samples of books that the kids read here heavily, just like any other kids across the city. And the thing is, is that their common theme that's in these books are dealing with social media. They talk about Twitter, they talk about Facebook, they also talk about Instagram, Pinterest, and the rest of them, the rest of them and on and on and on and on and on. They even still talk about MySpace. So I started thinking, I said, well, you know, our kids love technology. They're always talking about Facebook. They're always talking about Twitter. Why not create a Twitter account to communicate information to the kids? So here's our Twitter page. We finally had our 200 over 200 tweets. <laughs> I also take pictures for the wet school website and also the other events in the school. And when I was taking the pictures, the kids were like, where can we find these pictures? I said, go to the Twitter account. Right? So when I sent the kids to the Twitter account, then that's when I had a lot of students that began to follow the school Twitter account. This is what we do at our school. Uh, at, when students are enrolled at the beginning of every school year, the students must sign an acceptable use um, contract, and the parents must sign it, I really should say. So the parent or guardian is signing off on this contract, and one of the things that we include as a school is that we are going to use the, the student's image you know, by photo or video. And that really covers us, you know, in terms of the social media aspects. But one of the nice things about Twitter is that if someone sends you a direct message or they retweet your message, then if you have your email set up correctly, then what, it, what the system will do is send you a notification to your inbox. And oftentimes, if there's a really interesting tweet or a retweet, um, for example, I just forward that email off to my principal and his administrative team and they get a kick out of seeing that as well. In Chicago Public Library, Chicago Public Schools, I, I uh, follow mayor, the office of the mayor, Mary Manuel, because sometimes, especially during uh, cold and flu season, um, inclement weather, that Twitter page really does have some very good informative information on there that really affects our kids. The folks that are following us, okay. See, like AUSO interviewed me a while ago, so you know, of course, you know, I retweeted that one. <laughs> Couldn't help but do it. Today's 16 year old, and I'm sorry I'm preaching, but today's 16 year old is, is very different. And these kids tick different, they think different, they, they behavior is, is essentially very different. You have to find a way to meet them where they are, you know, and if, if technology is their thing, then that's where we have to go.